Hey, and welcome back to Very Hard Solo. Yeah, I'm super keen about this series now that I've started building. Very excited to continue. Um, I'm actually continuing on the same day as the last episode after getting home, and um, yeah, we'll do another episode, why not? LES. Okay, we need a farm, that's right. Yep, yep, yep. Where's my farming crap? Uh, it must be on the ground at the other place if it's not in that box. Super excited to build something awesome there. Gonna take our time. I guess it'd be like the Battle Axe series a bit. We spent like a ton of episodes building up that base. Um. Same sort of idea, essentially. I wouldn't mind going up the mountain today and just, like, grabbing a couple onion seeds. Do we have frost mead? Um... No. I don't think so. Maybe. Hey you guys, I'm back. We do need lots of boar meats. Whoa, we got a forest. Hell yeah, dude. Check it out. Uh, we are going to need to hit that, actually, because... Yeah. We need wood, lol. Actually, no, we used up the stone. We got wood. We don't have stone. No doubt we're going to need wood. I haven't even finished the first house yet. All the fine tuning and stuff, that's going to take up a lot of wood. All the furniture and beams I want to place everywhere to give a definition, etc. Oh, uh, yeah, so. I'm expecting like 500 wood to just go poof. But that's okay. That is okay. Oh, I'll leave these carrots there, I cannot be bothered. I think we're okay on carrots, it's just turnips. That's the big one that we're running out on. Tommy? 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 Where's your invitation? That's why you need a fence, dude. These bastards just walk up and start going for the crops. Complete and utter bastards. I call everything a bastard, but these guys are actually bastards for real. Like... They have no good intentions. They just go straight for your crops. They're pure evil. Literally. Unreasonable. Insane. Crazy. Ruthless. Bastards. Butted plants, bro. Later. Um... Dandelions growing in my campfire, got them growing in my my bed. Oh I can't get them apparently. That's alright. Um Okay, farming's done, we got 40 turnips, that's fine. Swap base is our base of operations until we uh get more done in this plane space. I think we gotta get stone. That's the big one. Like, did I really bring all my stone? I guess I did, I just... Wow, blew through my stone like that, dude. It's... That's sad. I don't know if... I still don't know if we got frost meat or not. Let's make a batch. Oh, we do! Okay, great. Well, let's make more. You never know. And we'll want some for display anyway. 
it's like two blood bags five thistles i think and a great or fire because you know why not i think it's yeah something like that and then honey right right yeah Uh, turnip stew and sausages needs to be sorted out, so that bastard won't be on onion soup anytime, so keep pumping up the carrot soup. Sausages, that guy, and those guys, and oh boy. Yep. All meat, all meat, all meat. We can go on a massacre later. We, we, we can sort that out. Yes. We'll just have to go on a massacre. It's fine. They had it coming anyway. I think. Can we sleep? No? Okay, fine. Fair enough. Uh, we don't need the swamp pee anymore. Wood arrows, we got those still somewhat. Did we really, really run out of stone? Like, holy cow, man. I need to investigate this. That's absurd. It can't be. Yeah, there's 100 stone left. When you spent a thousand stone on this. Holy cow, man. Holy cow. Oh, hey. Bonus. Yeah, cozy little house. Oh, we can put this indoors. Holy cow, dude. What? Oh, shit. Is it good? This is why we need the root vest. Walk outside and get stung. Ah yes, but of course. Welcome to the plains. Yeah, these aren't going to go here, probably. This is our chill area. I mean, we could have repair stations here, but I'm not going to do my crafting or storage in here, I think. Um, we're going to have buildings for different purposes. But having a repair station seems okay. Continue the landscaping. Oh. Yeah, we need to get rid of this hill here. It's a bit... A bit much. Yeah, I need a brazier or something somewhere on that side because we lose the resting buff. And that's gonna make me very sad. I don't have to go too crazy with this because we're going to put a stone road probably somewhere. I don't know what exactly we're going to do. 
I'll fill this in for now. Because having a big dirt patch is ugly. Ah yes, ultra fog yet again. Wow. But hey, it's better than constant rain, which is what you get in the meadows. <clears throat> Come on, stamina. Okay, that'll do for now. Um... What do we want to do first? Well, we're gonna need stone. Uh... Uh, yeah. Losing the resting buff going up the stairs is very annoying. I didn't actually do what I said I would do and look at fixing this. I'll just have to improvise. These are just temporarily there. Uh, let's see. I think the fog is finally clearing. Let's do some archway enjoyment. I think we should get one here. Okay. I mean, to be honest, it could go all the way up. Yeah, I mean, why not? What about that side? Yeah, it's fine that side too. a way to waste wood, but hey. I think it's a bit more of an interesting texture, just slightly. I'll sort that bit out later. Now, the corners. Um, 
I'm interested to try this out, kind of snapping, uh, shift placing them in without snapping and making them pop out a little bit like that. Kind of gives a bit more definition to your build essentially. Um, might be something we can do since we have this flat surface. And it's sunsetting, of course. It'll probably be raining when I wake up, but you know. Um, now this front bit. Yeah, we'll do something with the windows. Something you can do to make your roof a little more exciting is... Have a little bit of extra framing on the edge. Like so. It's a small thing, but it adds definition to your house. It's quite nice, I find. We could chuck that in there, although I'm not really sure about doing that. Maybe just like that is better. And let the darker. Dark would stand out a bit more. I see so many people, and I also made this mistake as well when I like first started building, is overusing the dark wood. Like, just spamming it everywhere in your house. But I don't think it looks great if you overuse it. Obviously, I need to fix this, but we can do that. Oh, guess what? It's raining time. Hooray. Wonderful. Um, but yeah, Duckwood, in my opinion, doesn't look that great if you just spam it everywhere. It looks really good when you just have small particular sections of it highlighting your house. Or whatever. As you can see, we're kind of like burning through the wood, but that's okay. I'm kind of thinking like this whole level could be dark wood almost. Uh, uh, then how do I do this pillar thing? Maybe I can't do the pillar thing. You're doing it like this, you want to zoom in all the way and try and put it in the corner as much as possible, like evenly. I think this one needs to be brought out a bit more, like that maybe. Yeah. That's an option, we can have this going all the way around, maybe. We should use the uh, big pieces because that'll save tar and also instance count. We might end up with a lot of instances, it's possible. I mean, we could have it there. It's not impossible. Leaving that bit blank though over the windows because I'm not sure just yet. And we could do something like this here. So regular wood will rot in the rain, however dark wood will not. What if I just stack it like that? Have this as like a little fence thing. Nothing particularly special. Uh, actually we should probably use this. This would look way better. Then you can also see through it. I like to have these alternating because they actually have a pattern on them and I didn't realize this for like a whole year dude. But there's a pattern on it and it changes. It's like 
not symmetrical or whatever. So you actually want to alternate them to kind of make the pattern make a bit more sense, I suppose. But of course, this is where all your fine wood in the world is going to disappear. Um, so yeah. But we're going to go on uh, another uh, deforestation spree with our friend anyways. My problem now is it feels almost too... Um... High. I kind of want it to be half that height. Also, I think this floor is snapped incorrectly. Yeah, it's snapped to that beam that I shift placed away. When it needs to be snapped to this, which is actual diameters of the house. Parameters of the house. So what we can do is that. Now we can kill this part and do that. And then we can shift, we can just flip these in like that. And get like a half wall with it. Now we rotate and get these bits in. a bit tricky. I've got to use a different side now. Am I doing that right? No, I think I've messed this up. Okay, that's right. That's right. That's wrong. Where did all my... Ah, oh, my tar, man. I'm running out of tar. Oh, yeah, gonna need more tar. That actually looks really nice without the thing on it. Um. There we go. That looks really nice if I just leave it like that. It does kind of clip through the ground a bit. So... What we can do is grab stone and maybe fill in that area below it. basically have a little balcony thing here, which is really nice. I'm tempted to extend the roof out and kind of cover this area. That's just one house, not even finished. Really? I have to block in the chimney completely. 
Oh, wow, okay. I didn't realize it would be like that. Um... Oh, wow, okay. Okay then, dude. There we go. Hey, the rain stopped. Also, I should probably do, like, this over the top. Oh, man, wood. Well, that doesn't have to be there anymore. I think that's pretty good, honestly. Oh, we still have to sort out this side. Wow. Actually, I wasn't finished up there, was I? Well, we don't know. Do we want this to come out more? I don't know about this doorway. It might be a bit over the top. We can do that on the window. And then, yeah, put the dividers in here. Yeah, looting the resting buff like that. Very unacceptable. So. Hanging braids here, all of our bronze. one up there I suppose. That should cover the rest of this part. Um, yeah that's fine. Oh yeah. Splish splush. Chains, chains, coal, nails, why not? 
Let's just get a comfort buff up here, maybe. Okay. Yeah, well, I mean, we could just put the comfort down. Let's grab that. Get the comfort buff up over there. I don't know, I'll do blue and white banners or something. White banners. The black banners just look the best. Maybe I'll just do the black banners. Not waste the berries. And we need an armor stand, which is leather. Iron nails we can make over there. I guess we can take these ones. The table. The chairs. We want a stupid raven throne, I suppose. I think it's time to sleep. We need to hit a bunch of wood and stone soon. But I just want to get this house done. Uh, at least progress it a bit more. The coal deliveries are very kindly appreciated. Hey, guess what? Bog again? Bog again. Are oh, you gonna break? Why is it all blue? Yeah, looks good. Don't think it's breaking. So that's awesome. So now, do I lose the comfort buff at all? No. There are no blind spots for comfort. Or here. Oh, there is still a blind spot. Wow, really? Right here. So I'm going to go right up to the wall, but wow, it still exists. Huh. Well, we could technically move it back a little bit more. It's probably fine, though. It'll be much better. Okay, so yeah, fine wood is used in like half the freaking comfort items, bit of tar, let's see, and we need nails. Oh. We want like two rugs here ideally like this i'll just leave it half done i'll just use these for now this can just go upstairs Eleven. 
I want the buff to be universal, or at least in a larger area. Stuff kind of has to be a bit central. For now. Temporary. Is that everything? Seems like a comfort 13. Yeah, that's all we... All we need. Uh, the hot tub, but... I don't know. We can try doing something funky with that. Hot tub costs a lot of crap. It's something like that, or what? Yes. We also gotta do something with the roof for it. I'm gonna need more wood. Um... Oh, we could have a hot tub room up here. A bathroom. Where's the roof? Um, this could be a bathroom, like, right here. And I'm gonna use this bit of roof and do stuff. Something like that. And funnel the smoke out. I wonder if that's enough. That might be, it might not be. We'll see. Can it get out? No, it cannot. So we need to use this roof bit then. Seriously, why do you have to punch it when the hammer breaks? What's wrong with you? Why do, why do you need to punch? You freaking idiot. I'm angry too. That the hammer broke, but dude. Don't have to punch our creations. David. Dude. Not cool. This is the easiest way to kind of fit a hot tub in your house. Let's just do that with the roof. It's not the best thing ever, but it gets the job done, so hey. We might wall off our bathroom for some privacy. Put that raven throne somewhere else. To line it up a bit with the roof so we can do this bastard here and this bar yeah but then it's gonna leave a a thing in the roof so I don't know actually but if we just do it like that is it really that bad if we have a gap that's a bit awkward doesn't even need to be like yeah. Because the, the wall could just, like, 
a part way up. I can do something like that. A bit of that. Some of this here. In fact, it doesn't. Yeah, you, you could you could just do that. Uh, is that gonna stick through the roof? No. Good. It really, it doesn't stick through the roof. No. Ah. Oh, cool. Okay. Great. I mean, that obviously will. Yeah, I don't know. It's... Is that gonna stick through? Yeah, that doesn't look great. Like, this doesn't even look bad, that chimney bit sticking out for the hot tub. we can make it out of this to make it a bit fancier. Not sure how to do this wall here though. Around the bathroom. So this stupid chair needs to move. Get out of the way. Just have a throne in the hot tub room. I mean, why not? Oops. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Maybe it's fine. Don't know, don't care too much. To be honest. Guitar. So we have a functional bathroom in the house. Didn't lose my comfort, that's good. Nothing strange sticking through the ceiling, that's also good. Excellent. for now. Okay, so wood and stone definitely need more before we build more. We've got three stacks of stone and only six or seven stacks of wood there. What's next? It's a good looking house. I like it. The chimney is awesome. Yeah, it's a very nice house. We'll add more to the front later. Still gotta work on the windows. I might come back to that. I think a house like right here would be nice, near the water. Maybe the storage could be here? Because it's near where the boat pulls up. Be kind of cool. Although we're also looking at the idea of having the boat come in here. But maybe it doesn't have to. I mean, that would just be a pain to get it in and out and turn it around. Having our port here would be pretty decent as well. Maybe a boat house here, boat storage house kind of thing. It's got, um, you know, all the boxes in here, and then 
a pier for the boat to pull up next to to unload it easily and stuff could be nice do something like that Yeah, definitely need to sort out these windows, but that can wait. Yeah, I think we should get the storage house up. Once I have these two houses, we'll need to make a spot for the smelters, but that can be nearby somewhere. Um, not sure where. We'll find a spot for that, though. Somewhere near this area. It could be over here. And the boathouse kind of over here. A storage house, whatever it is. Yeah, and just have the smelters over there. I mean, I don't think we need too much of them. Too much space for them. Basically just build around this lake. Really nice area. One second! Well, let's start with the wood. That's kind of easy. How much are we going to bet it's raining in the meadows when we go back? Going to bet a lot. Oh, uh, we need some sort of portal here. Uh, where the hell is my portal? Right. Okay, let's use the transport portal. Uh, so rename this to... I don't know. Go through S. Rename this one to transport. Uh, let's get our spear. I need the spear to attract his attention. It's in here, isn't it? Somewhere? Spear has its use just for attracting attention. Ultra fog, no rain. We just got the fog instead, but that's alright. Don't have a stamina penalty. Okay, so who have we got today? Hello? Anyone here? I need an assistant urgently. There is lots of wood to be harvested in my backyard forest. Well, it's actually the front yard forest. Hello? Hello? Come on, there has to be somebody here, somewhere. Hello? Dude. That's not funny. We need a troll! Come on, dudes. Oh, there's nothing here. Guess I gotta go way up north again. Dude. No, it's cool. I think I went last episode without dying. I survived the planes. Pretty happy about that. 
We survived the planes. We died a bunch of time. I think the Black Forest has killed me the most. I only died once in the swamp. But the Black Forest <laughs> has kicked my ass. It's actually dangerous and uh, very hard. I can't let my guard down. My guard is always up in the planes. I actually just can't see anything through the freaking fog. I need a troll, like seriously. Oh yeah, we need you guys too actually. We need ball mate. Yeah, there's not a lot of troll action in our Black Forest here. It's kind of disappointing. I don't need this meat, I'm pretty sure about that. Well, actually, if we tame wolves. I think we should tame wolves this playthrough because two stars are much more common, which is nice. Don't have to go through that excruciating pain in the Battle Axe series. Um, and they also are scaled up with very hard, so tamed animals are going to hit like trucks. It's going to be fun, dude. You thought the two star wolves were strong on normal mode? Well, oh, very hard. They go chomp chomp. And things die fast. I need a troll. Hello. Yeah, so where have our depths been? Day four, died in the forest. Um, day 19, Elder kicked our ass. Yep. Day 40, Grey Dwarf Fruit bonked us. Poison to death. Day 30, only four deaths, that's not too bad, not great, but yeah, we'll see what's to come in the mountain, the mountain could be brutal. What's going on over here? Holy shit, <laughs> did you see that? <laughs> wow, the boar killed a skeleton, holy shit. Wow, what a giga chad. <laughs> Just tore it apart. Yeah, you don't get that outside of very hard, really. Wow. Yeah, like on normal mode, you know, higher level mobs take hits from lower level mobs and then just smack them. But on very hard, whoever gets the first strike freaking wins pretty much. Where are the trolls? Tommy, what are you doing? On um, very hard, the... Uh, yeah, it's just whoever gets the first strike, pretty much, because everything does insane damage. But there's just no trolls in this forest. It's kind of a disappointment. Um, I'm not chopping those trees with a bronze axe. I'm telling you that right now. So, if there is no troll when we go back, then we'll just go hit stone instead. Skeleton, yeah, you better be scared. No skellies left. See? Go, get him. <laughs> Holy shit, dude.
fucking Gigachad boars. He probably could have killed that guy without my help. Like, he, he got the freaking hit in there and avoided his attack. He's a freaking gamer boar. <laughs> Yeah, mob vs mob shenanigans, one of my favorite things in this game, the different factions killing each other. Okay, so the trolls appear to be unavailable for assistance today. So... Boo, for starters. Keep our eyes open. We'll go down here, maybe we've got some luck this way. Also need these guys. Thank you. Oh, there's free wood here. I think my axe broke. I couldn't finish the job here. Log troll, I'll probably leave it alive because they're really good for wood cutting. Oh, hello, Frederick, my friend. I've been looking for you. Where have you been all these years, man? Just trying to get the mushrooms. What do you mean, no room in inventory? Excuse me, I need the mushrooms. Hold on a sec. Okay, let's go, dude. It's time to begin the deforestation. It's your fault, Tommy! Oh, your fault, Tommy! Frickin' prick! Would be much better with a log troll, but we'll just take this idiot, replant, and use a log troll next time if we can get one. 
I'm gonna be careful not to die. Like, the trees could get me low enough or even stagger me. The patrol can smash me. And I'm sure that attack will still one-shot me. Because that hits twice because it's been bugged for three years and they still haven't fixed that. That ground slam crap. It hits the player twice. For some stupid reason. Not sure why that's not fixed. But... Same reason. I'm not sure why waterproofing isn't a thing yet, so you can do that nice outdoor builds. But hey. Early access. Oh, the squad has rocked up. Dude, don't have all day. Just punch. Let me help. Stop. Tommy. Bit of an idiot. I'll just get to work myself. It appears to be lost. Blank rock throw crap. Oh my god, you idiot. Let's try breaking the stuff up there then first. That's it. How you missed the train? Oh gosh. Stomp, 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 stomp.
pretty good. It's good because of the hill as well. We have gravity on our side as well. Tommy. Nice, dude, you're helping. You're not helping. close. Nice, that was a good one. Come in here, in here dude. Come here. I don't like the fact there's a blue boy here. There we go. I think he's lost in the woods. Yeah, he's just lost. Given up on life. You really weren't that impressive. Five thousand grey dwarfs are gonna rock up. Cause I'm chopping wood at night. Well that's not a bad thing, we'll get tons of grey dwarf fires I guess. No, maybe it's fine. Oh he's coming back. You're not done for the day, man. Oh shit, the axe broke. Um, excuse me? This is not your house? What are you... Excuse me? Sir. Sheesh. Oh shit. That's not good. Um, where's the campfire box? Dude, that's my smelter, bro. What is wrong with this guy? I want to be rested before I deal with him. Oh, 
Oh, it's too strong for you. What a shame. Don't think you like that. Where's my spear? What do you got against my house, man? I know I'm annoying, but like... Where the hell did my spear go? Oh, I guess we'll find it another day. Alright. There's wood to destroy here, bro. You want to smash things? Smash this. Ah, excellent. Everyone's pulling up. Yes, it's Friday night. That's right, guys. Would be so much better with a log troll. This guy's an idiot. Still got a standing forest over here, bro.
and the hell are those next doing? Sneaking into my house when I'm not looking. Well, the bees killed it, so hell yeah. Good job, bees. Killer bees to the rescue. Oh, you suck, dude. Sparkles everywhere, man. Freaking idiots. This shaman is like blind or something, dude. Oh, there he goes. Bro. Hey, you hit it. I gotta get rid of the stunts, dude. Dude, not the farm. Nice! Should be like 2,000 wood. Those ones then. Ready. What was that? Oh, there's a birch here, dude. And the stump here. Nice. What about this stump? These two? Can you hit both? Are you that good? Yeah. Oh, nice. Ow. Oh, gentlemen. Oh no, you got that one, nice. Then it's just this one. Nice, dude! Good one! Good! Oh wow, he's killing it now! Wow, what a giga chad! If we have to kill him, so I want to get a log troll. Should make this a lot easier.
You missed. What the hell was that, dude? Showing off your dance moves or what, man? Um, take out these couple stumps. There's like one or two stumps and bits of logs, but that's just about done after this, I think. Good. Yep, let's grab this one. Nice. Maybe these ones here, dude. Can you get both? No. There we go. What about this one here? No, you missed, dude. Thank you for your service. Muchly appreciated. You did great. Bastard nets. Messing up my stuff, dude. I hope that's enough box space. This crap needs its own box. This stuff is really like whatever. Um. Matter of fact, I'll put like some of this crap in a box to save space, I think. Alright, let's go. Oh, fine wood. Of course. Should be a grip of fine wood as well. And then just stacks of 50 of normal wood everywhere. <laughs> Oops. Didn't want to pick that up. Uh, I don't know, man. This, this crap can just... Uh, normal wood. One of carding it would be more efficient, definitely possible. But that requires me to go through port portal light screens, get the cart, wheel the cart over, deconstruct the cart, blah blah blah. Or I can do it like this and get run levels. If I had to run further, I'd use something else. But I don't. So I think it's fine. It's just stacks of 50 everywhere. There's so much crap on the ground, it all combined into stacks of 50, essentially. It's pretty insane. When I need more boxes.
and eventually we'll find SB. Imagine doing this without a Megan Yule, though. <laughs> Seeds. Xbox. Oops. someone complained about you know using a troll to hit wood is a bit cheesy but I don't think anyone wants to watch me hit trees with an axe for an hour straight that's kind of a bit boring and repetitive trolls a lot faster especially with compared to like a bronze axe if you get like a black metal axe sure it's not actually that bad chopping but the early game? Oh no thanks. Would take forever. It's also a bit more interesting with the troll, you know. I was in risk of dying a couple times there. It's moderately entertaining at least. But it's just a bit grindy getting resources in the early game. Way too grindy. They need to reduce the health on copper ore or something. It's Hitting copper with an antler pickaxe is actually just a joke. How bad it is. Once you have the iron pickaxe, hitting ores is fine. Like hitting silver is fine. Hitting, if you're doing it conventionally, although who does that? Um, I need more box space. It's kind of sad it's come to that. Here we go. Yeah, hitting stuff with an iron pickaxe is fine, but... Nah, dude. Not with the antler pickaxe and then the... Yeah. You can make a bronze pickaxe, but that's crap as well, and... Who wants to invest 10 bronze into that? I mean, come on. No one does that. I do wish they'd make the bronze sage a bit more 
enjoyable, less grindy. It's okay the first time you play the game, it makes you sink a bunch of hours into it, but I wonder how many people just stop playing before they've touched iron, because it's very grindy, and then the rest of it's kind of chill. Like, iron is super easy, because, you know, it's just tons of iron in the boxes for you. No magic with that. Silver. Silver's pretty easy, and you don't even need that much silver. There's not so much stuff to make with silver, but bronze is used for, like, everything. Used for your boat, it's used for your furniture, your cultivator. Alright, well, okay, there's a little bit more, but I think that's just about everything. Sir? Um, what the hell do you think you're doing to my house? Huh? I think we are done. What is with this boar? Definitely feel the speed on the bow much, much faster. Oh yeah, 33. So it's like 50% faster or something. Not 50% faster, but at least 25% faster or something like that. No, wait. 75% of the original draw time, something like that. I don't know. But when you get to bows 100, essentially the draw speed is increased by like four times or something. Therefore it's 80% faster to pull back an arrow at max level. And by the time you get like level 50, 60 on bows, you really start feeling machine gun effect on it. Pole arms at 45 is pretty good. Swords is slowly getting there, but we haven't used it a lot. Using it on the fuelings, I'm not sure about that. We might use it a bit on the mountains, so we'll see. I think with wolves and stuff, we want to snipe them. Okay, so this is transport. That should go directly to our plane's base, therefore. Um, all the stuff we don't need can go in here. All the heavy crap, like all this, 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 this. Goes here. And we take this and this as well. As much wood as we possibly can. Feathers, no. Should only have to do two or three trips. And this goes directly to the house, which is great. Well, box has been filled. <laughs> Hell yes. And a little bit of stone. The so stone is next. Let's do something smart. Let's put the portal right next to the boxes. For now. I don't know, just put it like there. Fine. And we'll probably want another box. For wood. So how much is in here? Six times the twenty-four stacks. That's um. Well, the wood is two each, so it's twelve hundred wood. Yeah. All right. Let's get the rest. I'm hoping we have like two thousand. To be honest, we'll see. Two thousand would be a good amount. So what do we got? Three stacks here. You there, the feathers. Oh yeah, we got a lot actually. Wow. Yeah, 
There we go. Bang. Holy. Okay. Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. No, 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 not now, not now, not now. He's angry. Where's the other one? Oh shit, I don't have my weapons. Ah, that's awkward. Um, oh, horrible timing, guys. What are the chances of that? Where's the other one? Fighting in the mist somewhere or what? This guy is being such a weirdo. Like, is he okay? What's wrong with this troll? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh no. Bad timing guys. Shit. This is bad. This is real bad. Oh my god, I don't have my weapons, guys. No, not my staff. I don't have my weapons. This is so freaking annoying. Stupid raid, the worst timing possible. The freaking two minutes I spend transporting stuff. Now they decide to raid me. Oh no, dude. I need my app gear. Oh. I don't know what to do. Shut the door, repair the house later. I think I slam the door in their face while they're running around like idiots. Get my stuff. That's some bad timing, guys. Some really, really bad, bad timing. Really need my ant gear for that. Like, holy cow, man. Hello? Can I sleep on the bed? They'll probably still be there, because they're pricks. Oh, for frick's sake. Why is everyone out to get my house today? Bruh, I still need to replant that forest. So I'll leave a box here. With all this crap in it. That needs to go to the swamp base. Cultivator and spear. This can stay here too. Where's my food? Is it in a box or what? Top one? Yeah. Antler pick, we want that. Oh yes, building materials. Everything's in the wrong order. Shop. Okay, I guess get ready for a fight when we come through here. Don't one-shot me when I come out of the portal, please, guys. The 
are they gone? Did that just taste? Oh, there they are. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You come back, you prick. Revenge. Oh shit! He's oh shit! Oh god! Oh god! Yeah, get him! Oh, Four eighty-seven. Well, they're getting him good though. Get him! Uh oh. Holy 500 damage, dude. Wow. God bless the Tarblobs. Here to save us. And yeah, my house looks pretty good. From distance, I like it. Might need to adjust this bit I put on the front, but other than that, it looks good. Okay, so we have 2,500 wood plus more, 2,400 plus that. So about, yeah, 2,589. <clears throat> Pretty good. I think we have what we need. Bronze nails? Yes. Actually, no, we don't need to do that. We poured all the stone back. Um, let's replant our forest while we're not in immense danger. Dude, do I really just get three birch seeds out of all that? Are you freaking serious? Three? Three? Wow. Yeah, the return rate on birch seeds is pretty depressing. Unsustainable. This produced double the seeds. Oh, that's too close. It's so hard to see. Bad Tommy. That'll do, really. That's like over a hundred. I'll just leave our planting crap here, I suppose. Why not? We'll take all this back to the swamp, and we need to go to the swamp and also get some more stuff. Got what I needed, but I needed something from the swamp. stuff oh 
yeah, we got this portal for the swarm. Yeah. I've got a swarm dump our inventory there because all the dump boxes are at the swamp. Still our main base of operations. Eleven of those is nice. Yeah, have a bit of wood here, why not? Emergency supply. Carrot soup, for some reason, is running out first. Uh, weird champ, but alright. Um... Portal supplies, portal supplies. That. Fine wood we get at the planes. That. And fine wood at the planes. I guess I'll take the ten wood as well, sure. Probably time to sleep. Looks pretty dark, no? Oh, I lied, alright. Uh, S, I don't know. Uh. I guess I have to go through the meadows base because the transport portal's there, that's fine. Now. Don't need any of that, right? Uh, I think we're. Oh, hang on a sec. So we need 40 of these bad boys. We could put down a couple boxes in advance for when we get the stone. Um. And okay, I want portal for safety like that oh uh, not s it'll be transport or blank use the transport portal blank should be clear but I'll sort that out later stone that'll be our stone portal um okay and triple locks right there let's not mess with them Four pillars right over there. How close are the village idiots? Are they gonna bother me? Plenty of fine wood right here, actually. Oh gosh. I got that's a thing? Yep. Oh man, it's all gonna go in the water. I don't know how I feel about that. Wow, there's like three pillars there and like four over here. Holy cow, we got stone forever. Awesome. Okay, it's gonna rain, but of course. Yeah, why not? It's in the water, but I'm pretty sure it's super shallow water, so I don't really care. Each of these pillars gives, like, uh, between 300 and 400 stone, or 350, 350 to 400 on average, I think. Uh, fastest way to get mass amounts of stone. 
Another way, which is dangerous, is um, using a golem in the mountains and smashing mountain rocks. Pickaxe the stones while the golem smashes. And um, you can actually get stone pretty fast that way. I was doing that on the last series. But I wouldn't recommend that on very hard difficulty because one mistake and the golem goes smash and you die. Even in the best armor. Unless you go like triple food or triple health food or something. I love the effect though, that's awesome. mind feeding those locks although it's yeah sort of a waste if you can't ride them you can't get them to safety yeah i think we do the wolf taming first miss any oh there's a bit over there gotta check because it could also be a stack of 50 all right well we'll drop this off and move to the next one another tar pit right over there how much is that Wow, actually over 400. Nice, we've got a good roll. Above average amount. Uh... Yeah, we should really put all this crap over here, I think. That would be wise. And have this as a dedicated stone box. This can be wood and other crap, but stone should be, you know, in the stone boxes. Should be together. Is this sleep time yet? Don't know. Yeah, um, the tar thing. Got my tar gathering kit. There's a lot of blobs in this one. Hire some assistance. Or we could bring the TARS to the fuelings. much in here. Is that just one idiot? I think he's gonna get wrecked. 
What if they can deconstruct this for me? Nice. bit slow. I don't have a... oh, I do sort of have a blind weapon. I mean, they sit back. I think sorting them is the best way. The sledge is a bit too slow. Yikes. Alright, I need a more efficient way to kill these guys. I can break this for stone as well. It doesn't give that much though. No one or two hundred, but yeah, the pillars is probably better. locks to help. Dude. Uplop needs our help. Uh oh. Alright, this locks is stupid. So that's like the worst target to be honest. It's like three pools and you don't even get much, but it's local produce, we'll take it. Not gonna be picky about tar, we need a lot probably. In fact we used just about all our tar already, just on this tiny house. We're planning to build much more, so yeah, you know, that's not be picky. Just get whatever tar that we can. See about aiming these guys. Oh, 
I like to do it like this. As long as his friend doesn't notice me. Yeah, this is the problem. I snuck up to them just fine, but because he turned around to eat the freaking cloud berry, now he's kind of heard me or whatever. Oh shit. Um, how do I deal with mosquitoes without arrows? Um. Okay, where is this guy going? What in the frickin' hell? Just go home, dude. I think he went home. Dangerously close to me. Hey, he's teaming though. That is dangerously close. Holy cow, that is gonna kill me someday. Pretty sure about that. Yikes, dude. Just gonna see a lock's face freaking stick through the wall when I'm. Making arrows or something, probably. It's gonna scare the freaking living daylights out of me. <clears throat> Locks are scary already, but on very hard, holy shit, you're just dead. No two ways about it, you just die. Yeah, I can't be picky with this really. Let's just go. We'll drain it toward the ocean. Uh, this rock is kind of in the way. But hey, we could pickaxe it once we get rid of the tar, I guess. Oh shit. Not that deep. Okay, Brock, you have to go. <clears throat> Which is fine, I need stone anyway. Pick up that. I actually get stone just from digging this as well, by the way, so hey. Should be using this. Whoops. I'm kind of failing and that's getting deeper. Whoops. Oh my gosh.
Because tar should just vanish when it touches the water, I think. I think that's how it works. Get out. Being a bastard. Yeah, it's really not much power in here. As you can see, it's a freaking rip off this tar pit. But oh, whatever, we take it. Holy stone pillars, man. This, I didn't realize there's so many. There's another four right here. And there's three more over there. What an amazing spot, dude. It's got everything. Tar pits, villages, stone, totems, village idiots. Wow. And then obviously it's super gorgeous. Hell yeah. What a great seed. Great spot and a great seed. Um, now that I'm past my anguish and suffering from finding Haldor, you know, I'm appreciating the world a lot more. <laughs> That was the only bad part, finding Helldor. Oh, what's going on? Do we need to, like, cut this part here? Is that what's holding us up? My pickaxe broke, so come on, let's go. Yeah, this one's not really draining. Like, come on. Not sure what you want me to do. Don't think there's much in this bit anywhere. I think I got all the tar anyway. We're like done. Yeah, 70 to 62. That's pretty pathetic. Oh well. Uh, we're gonna have to repair.
All right. Um, let's see. Got a little bit of extras here. Freebies. We also have a forest here. We have a want fine wood. Might take a bit to be honest. We have some fine wood, but not that much fine wood. And tons are gonna go into like boxes and crap, I'm sure. But yeah, maybe we grab a bit of fine wood. With all these birches conveniently over here. Now, if I go any more over there, we're gonna attract the whole village. Um. I think there's still some big guys in there. Star, two star bastards. Sadly. This bit didn't get gone. Bit now. Oh, don't tell me my big stacks fell in here. No, I don't think they did. That's okay, just these ones. Uh, 368. Yeah, that's a pretty normal amount. So that's like 800 stone we have, plus whatever we already had, so 900. I mean, that's nearly a full box. No, that's yeah, 1100. Alright. Oh, yeah, we got a bit from the troll or something. And mining the tar out. Isn't that wonderful? All this for building. Excellent. Yeah. Um. But we kind of burned through so much stone last time. I want to get more. So I'm going to need to do terraforming and all sorts of crap. Do I dare? Yes. I want to hit this dude. This is so free. There's so much fine wood right here. This will be the forest that we hit to farm our fine wood out. Oh, they coming, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, God. Um, right. Well, if they split up... That's a one star. That might be another one star. I think it's two normals and two one stars. What? Is it just you by yourself? Oh, they're smashing my stuff. That's not nice, dudes. Appreciate it without your friend and this friend as well. Throw it, you bastard. Now, get rid of that thing first. Throw it again. What a great weapon. Oh. 
Aw, oh, man. He's short with the little punk. Uh oh. Just out of reach. Probably does like 40 a second if he hits me with that thing. Oh, this guy is a bastard. Or I'm just bad, but... Wow, what a prick! Else is laughing. Ah, you. Who? What? Good thing they're pretty easy to stagger. Yeah, this is not free really until the village gets wiped out. Oh, that's attracting more. Uh, Alright, well, we might abandon that idea of getting some fine wood until later. Because the village idiots are not too happy with me, it appears. So it appears. So, um, yeah. Never mind that. We need another box. Good thing we have a ton of iron. And those guys are there, that's right. Okay, let's use this for more wood and put everything else in another box. That's the junk box. So I've got wood, 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 and stone and stone. Um, yeah, I want more stone. Why did I go here? Nobody knows. I meant to go to the bed. I need wood. Is there wood in here? No, of course not. Window sill it is. Right, back to the planes. One more pillar for now. That puts us at like 1500 stone easily. Which you can do stuff with. Um, the forest is essentially marked for us. We'll go there and chop later, but it's not safe to do so now.
Abandon mission! Idiot. Bye. He'll be back. Here he comes. He's like, wait a sec, I came here for a reason. And that reason is to die. I think if we use needle arrows, probably stagger the one stars if we hit them by sneak. Or if we upgrade the bow, but I don't want to do that. On the bright side, we get needle arrows for the mountain, so that's going to totally destroy wolves. I don't even think we need needle arrows, though, because wolves are glassy, man. A sneak hit with this bad boy would probably do it. With a wood arrow. Oh, we'll get a lot of bow levels from killing the squawk spam as well. Pickaxe is 45. Holy shit, dude. A lot of mining. Yeah, maybe it's worth upgrading my iron pickaxe with how much freaking mining I'm doing. Durability, damage increase. Is that like my highest level? No, run is 55. Then second we have pole arms. And then third we have pickaxes. And then jump. Alright. Why's this stone all the way down here? Um, I think we got enough bow. For now, anyways. Wouldn't mind doing a bit more building. Is that all of it? I think that's... Yeah, 391. Pretty good. Pretty good haul. Yeah, so 1.2k plus yeah, 1.5k stone, 2.5k wood, we can do stuff with that. Heck yeah. Gonna make an awesome freaking village here. One of my best builds ever. Pretty keen for it. But before that, we take a small break because we've been playing for like two hours. So I'll be back in a bit. Hey. Alright. Uh, what were we doing? I think we just finished getting stone. Taking bricks is good. I definitely recommend it. That's why my Civ 4 video is only like one hour long. That game requires immense concentration. If you play more than an hour, your quality, your quality of gameplay just drops. In this game, it's not so bad. I can just play this all day, but like... Uh, I want to be in my best performance, and... I want to be able to focus, because I've got to do this bright. I'm trying to make a really nice space here. So... I have like a path with trees down here, and then... The little coastal dock house probably here now what's the greens in the ground situation it's gonna not be that even is it yeah well that's it we can go on the 45 -er, and then that'll work okay for our stone block placement i think i want it about that high in this area 
Not too low, not too high, kind of. It's the vibe right now. Get rid of this. And now flatten. about these bushes and stuff when I'm done terraforming I'll sleep to get rid of the rain I should have a nice line going here Pretty good. I might go a bit more into the water. still has cloud berries. And it should be like in the process of taming while they're doing all this. Oops. What do you mean, dude? The sneaking... Don't be like that. I was just trying to feed you, man. I 
should calm down in about 30 seconds. Uh, the other one's eating. Okay, so... Basically making a big warehouse for our storage. And a place to park the boat some point. Uh, we'll do the boat part of it later. I just want the storage up right now, to be honest. This needs to go. Seven blocks. Yeah, that's going to be a lot of stone. Ooh, he's dangerously close. Hope he tames soon. Yeah, it'll need to be a bit bigger. I don't really want to go much more this way, though, because I want a walkway here. So I'm not sure what to do about that. Also, a smelter area should be at the back here. Somehow, one way or another. I want a walkway. I mean, I guess I could raise the ground and stuff a bit. Do some... Terrain manipulate, uh, yeah. manipulate the terrain a bit.
We can do that. Make a bit more room to work with. I'll we'll have the pathway kind of there then. Toward the inside. And then bring this over one more. Now we're by seven. Because we also got to get a pier up somehow, sort of. And that's going to take a ton of stone, so we're definitely not doing that now. We're doing the essential stuff, not the stuff that we can live without. Um, okay, so how do I want to build this bastard? Need wood now. Still gonna do more building with that house as well, obviously. Um, still need some work, but just want to focus on this for now. Let's get what we need up first. Make it functional first, then make it beautiful, you know? Why is it running in place? I wonder how that taming is going. And I wonder how much room we really need. Quite a bit if we are going to have the crafting in here as well, to be fair. I kind of have a double door here. Or, nah, I think I should be bigger. Five each way. Gives me plenty of room for the boxes. Not only do we need box room, we also need crafting table, like forge, workbench, two late game ones, black forge, galder table, boxes, boxes, we have a row of boxes on one side. So maybe the boxes closer to the water and the forge and crap on this side. So one, two, three, four, five each side. Kind of want it to be symmetrical. Um, I'd like the workbench to be near the center, please. Yeah, I can do the smeltering stuff this side. That seems okay. Maybe it's paved road or whatever for it.
We'll make it a bit more interesting and add a few windows or whatever, but let's get this done for now. Stupid workbench needs to be here. That can go here for now. A little bit of fine wood and dark wood. Actually, we'll need a lot of. Oh, I mean, tar for the roof. The roof on this will be massive. It's going to use a lot. Nice of them to back off a little bit. I'm going to need a lot of wood for this bastard. So let's say that. And then that, that, that. And that. Workbench should be here. Forge should be here. Now, have most of the storage on this side, I think, and here. And then... Forge is the one where you need tons and tons and tons of metal. And you get encumbered, like... You get encumbered to make a silver sword. So you want the forge close to the storage for that reason. Although... The metal's gonna be way over there. Which is kind of annoying. Yeah, well. The other option is forge up here, storage over here. Storage can be both sides, to be honest. I think that's okay. Yeah, forge kind of... Forge and metal storage do need to both be over here. Closer to the smelters. Kind of has to be that way. Black forge can go next to the normal forge or whatever. So let's get stuff for the forge. Uh, huh? Missing one single stone. But of course,
They'll just do very, very basic windows like that. Just to let a bit of light in. Should still have a fireplace in here somewhere for the comfort buff. Good to have comfort in the storage. Oh, of course not. Um, but where would a fireplace go then? Nobody knows. Maybe two braziers would be okay. Toward the middle. It's a lot of bronze. I don't know why they have to be five bronze each. That is disgusting. We just don't have the bronze for that right now. So that's really not an option. Oh yeah, hammer. That's why I came here. In any case, let's start on the roof. Uh, I wonder if it's gonna need. I wonder if it'll need extra support or not. It's actually fine. Oh, I messed this up. Needs to overhang on the other side as well. Duh. Okay, well, let's sleep.
Okay, so what we want is our roof to start here. Like that. So that we can have an overhang essentially. Oh, you're raining again. Man, what a bastard. It rained while I was terraforming and now it's raining again. What an absolute prick. That's unbelievable, man. What the hell? What's wrong with you? really annoying actually because the wood is gonna rot that wall or the rain is gonna rot the wood on this side that's really annoying stupid freaking rain why twice in a row like that why why though but why Bastard. Yeah, now I have to repair all this. Great. Yeah, that's just wonderful. What a bastard. Wasn't that bad. Okay. Wow, that's all the wood. Alright. But. It actually looks pretty nice. Not bad for a freaking warehouse. Uh, tar, fine wood, and wood are like all extinct. Is that really all my tar? Gosh, the fine wood, wow. What the hell? Wow, that's all my tar as well. Oh my god. Oh no. Wow. I got no tile left. That's sad. What about fine wood? I don't have much fine wood either, to be honest. That's, um, yeah. Hmm. Wow. Not even done using dividers. What the, what the hell? Damn it. It's coal, not tar, but anyway. I can't believe that used that much freaking tar. I guess each freaking divider is two fine wood each. Yep, yep, yep. You don't need too much fine wood to progress the game, but once you start building nice stuff, oh! Hundreds and hundreds of fine wood go by. I want to take out that plains forest, but like... Ah, uh, the stupid goblin village is in the way a bit.
Let's make some needle arrows and clear those village idiots out, maybe. Oh, uh, we need this to be level four. Okay, well let's let's set up the storage room, set up the forge and workbench, upgrade them and stuff. That is something we can do. Um, so we want to go to the swamp, which would be the blank portal. So we have ets between swamp and meadows. We have transport between meadows and plains. We have blank between swamp and plains. Take that, take that. Almost enough flint, but not quite. The village will have flint for us. Uh, but I want it now. Oh, and if I made a harpoon, should make one of those. Uh, oh yeah, we have the, all these out. Why don't we use these arrows? Holy crap, I have 188 iron head arrows. <laughs> yeah, I got screwed on the boxes, alright. Holy cow, usually I only get like 50 or maybe 100 at most. Oh well, we'll put them to good use for these hee-haws. I still want to upgrade my stuff, so we got to go back to the meadows. This will go to the meadows. Um, ads is easy. We have the fine wood and bronze for that. Uh, we brought chains over. We can do the thingy, the bellows. We need flint. Just a little bit, only two. Forest is already back again. Good to see. And then dehyde, flint, leather, that's the other two things. And then, yeah, that's it for the bench. Anything else here I should be bringing? Um, not really right now. I don't have enough fine wood for all the boxes, so I don't want to bring, like, everything over. I just went through the wrong portal because I'm a dumbass, but maybe we'll grab some useful stuff here, who knows. Uh, what else do I need for these village idiots? More food, maybe? Maybe more food? Turnip stew is running out, so we can make a few of them. I really want to go to the mountain and just get, like, a little bit of obsidian so I can upgrade all my crap. Um, we might do that real soon actually. All I need is, is it five or six obsidian or four or something to get the tool shelf. I have the fine wood, oh, sort of, and I have the um, iron. So yeah, doing that would be nice. Need to go do the farm again soon, but maybe we get mountain seeds, uh, the onion seeds while we're in the mountain as well, and then, yeah. Do I need any of this? No, not really. Money? Nah. Entrails, bones. I don't need any of that stuff. Um. Still raining because it's a bastard. We have wood here. Uh, I don't think that's enough.
Oh, I got that thingy. Nice. Upgrades and do the bellows. Need one of those grinding wheels. Where are my chains? Four chains, bellows. the 10 copper for the thing we do bellows this thing's a bastard oh wait we're missing stuff now we need this one This bastard right in the corner with the bastard. That's the worst one to place. This thing can just like go outside, or maybe not. Okay, somehow that works. Sure. Really? That's level four? Do we have 25 fine wood? Yeah. For now. The bucket. Level five. And 59, level six. Level seven is irrelevant until we're in black metal era. Need more than this much help because a mosquito can just end me right now. That would not be ideal. Things running out. Okay, we can do like four boxes. Uh, so yeah, let's put some boxes down just to get this place started up a bit. This open door sort of thing. I'm gonna do this on every side. We'll put the dividers in there eventually. Leave them. Do this. Uh, okay, these bad boys, yes. Uh, 
Actually, I'm gonna purposely separate them a bit because I might replace these with black metal boxes later on. So I'll make room for that in advance. Okay, wood, wood. Divider here. Stone, stone. No wood left. Got a little bit. I don't know if the black metal chest will fit in there. Might need to be a bit higher. Many more boxes. Actually, I probably want like more boxes for wood and stone, but whatever, this will do for now. I suppose we could move those boxes. Let's take a break from this though and actually just go for a mountain expedition. I need to go to start a base and grab my stuff. I want to use the blank portal, so... What we're going to do is rename... The one at the swamp. This portal... You're not being used, we'll take you with me. To save Finewood, because we're like running out. Except the meads are at the swamp, aren't they? Yep. do the cooking in my new house. I'll just take the frost mead with me. I have a lot of healing. Like too many. What about needle arrows? We have another plains portal, okay, and that goes village then. Right, almost messed up. Right, but yeah, the plains portal is over there. Maybe I should do farming, to be honest, because I'm running very low on stuff. Might be a wise idea.
a lot of turnips. Um... Oh, okay, magically goes sunny, I'm not sure. It's gonna take a while to build up this village. But we're gonna be using it for the rest of the game, so it's alright. Mix in progression with building and stuff. carrots here. Well, one day we'll be able to cook here, so it's fine, I guess. Take three, leave three. Um, the sun is, like, still in the east, kind of, so plenty of time left, I think. Though I think the iron hit arrows should be fine. Needle is what I need for the fueling village. Which is what I need to do to unlock fine wood, so... Just chill on that for now. We'll go iron hit in the mountains. All we want is a little bit of obsidian. So the blank portal should be... Yeah, available for me to get the hell out of the mountain. Great. Let's go on an adventure now. You bastards will get it. Not, not today. Well, not now at least. Oh. More tar up there, is that? No. There's tar over there, we haven't even got that's a big one as well, that's gotta have like a hundred in it. The good mountain is up there. Oh, we've got village idiots here. Oh, with the tar pits. Okay, watch out for wolves. We're on very hard difficulty. Don't let the guard down. Oh, 
by the skitter cycle. What the hell? How far can this save go? Cave there. No Fenris pants would be kind of cool. Shit. Really? Oh. Damn squawking bastards. Why are you flapping around like an idiot? Shut up. Obsidian, anyone? Okay, yes. this right here. Oh. Do actually want the wolf loot? Oh shit. Likely for silver here. Sounds like someone's gone after my stuff or what? Yeah, this one's being a prick. Hello, thank you. Should take the stag breaker. Less stamina drain. Oh, 
dudes. There's a golem there. Yeah, of course it'd be a lot easier if I had freaking wishbone. Don't have to worry about silver today though. It's like the base is not even set up yet. It's just, yeah, can't even do anything if we do, even if we do get silver. That's fine, I guess. Big thing is we just got obsidian to do the stuff. Which means we'll want our troll hide. And if we're doing caves, we probably want... Probably want... Troll armor, not... Root crap. So we don't get obliterated. So, hold on a sec. We'll do a triangle. We'll need some bones as well to upgrade the troll stuff. Just got level 4 troll chest and pants. Maybe we survive the fire if we get burned that way. But if we go in with a root vest, we definitely won't be surviving the burning, I can tell you that. We'll get incinerated. Also, we can make like ooze bombs or something. Resin, leather. And use the poison arrows on the cultist bastards. Yeah, actually, why not? Pump them. Yeah, I'd like to get my Fenris pants done first. It's a. Uh... Armor increase and a speed increase. It's just a win-win. This bastard can also go level 4, by the way. It's only 6. Um, take more of that. Let's see. 5, 2, 4, 6. 17 each. Well, 17 for a fresh chest and then 6, I think. 2, 4, 6, 12, 5, 17. Yeah. Both of those level 4. Um, the root thing will be like some amount of ancient bark. I'll just take this to be safe. And we want to go back to the plains. Oh, we wanted ooze bombs, which will be lots of leather. Just take all the leather and maybe more resin. It'll be good if we get a cultist room with like friggin' four or six dudes in seen those before. But yeah, I'm going to take precautions now. We're actually up to the danger biomes officially. How much for this one? 15, okay. So... have a troll tunic somewhere but oh well who cares more than enough freaking troll hide that's for sure now these bastards oh we should have grabbed our poison arrows Still need a lot more storage here. I'm just gonna dump this crap in here for now. Oh, 
Let's sleep so we don't get night spawns bothering us. That bastard should be tame pretty soon. Don't know about the other one. But I think the berries might have despawned, so I need to feed it more. Right, we'll deal with that later. Better to do that while we're hanging around the base building. Switch just so we're in um render distance. The team progression. Uh so Swamp Base has the poison arrows. We can probably just put the wood ones away, to be honest. I'll keep them on me. Can spam them for levels whenever we feel like it. Well, actually, no inventory slots. <laughs> ah, yeah, the inventory slot thing doesn't really work like that, does it? I don't think we need a frost meat in the cave. So perma cold buff is pretty annoying and we can make more mead. Is there like this? Yeah, this box is kind of free. Let's just put bear crap in here, like we don't need any of this in the cave. That's useful. I'll just stow that temporarily. Let's go dude. We go cave and might be a dud cave anyway. Just use that so I don't have to deal with the cold buff. You know the cold buff is like minus 50% health regen or something. It actually sucks. 25% stamina. No reason to play with that. Uh, it's a bat hole. Alright guys, come. You know what? Just work on- oh no, it doesn't work on them. Wow. Holy shit, they're messing me up. Oh my god, very hard bats hurt. I can't just let them hit me. Ah, they hurt. Alright, you bastards. Ah. Uh. Two doors, nice. Wow, they take a hit from an iron sledge. Okay. I'm causing a lot of destruction down there. Oh yeah, by the way, I learned this a little bit too late, but smashing these gives you way more crystals. Nine instead of four. I don't know why that's a thing, but that's a thing. Smashing them is way better than picking them up. Would have been nice to learn that before I farmed like 500 in the last series, but hey. Oh boy. Let's see how you like poison, you bastards. How's that poison going for you, dude?
bronze, right. Get my bronze from these guys, yeah. I love that about the caves, that they actually give you bronze. Super good, because bronze is a pain in the ass. We don't have a black forest close by either. Don't sit down, you idiot. Oh shit. Spin to win. Panic. Oh, Doggo Central in here. trails now. I think we've got just about everything. Oh gosh. Resilient bastard. Bastard cultists at. Oh, shit. Eat that, you bastard. gentlemen. health dude what a prick what was that reach i gotta replay that holy shit man <laughs> got me some from so far away bastard what's this business with the surviving with one hp pricks Huh? 
Oh yeah. That's huge. Tick, 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 tick. Unlucky. Poison is huge against Frost Cave mobs. They deliberately made poison do like extra damage to them. It's really cool. So you don't see much uses for poison. This is one of the rare cases. It's great. Oh, double cultist. Oh, nice. Thank you, gentlemen. All right. Well, we got our Fenris stuff. Good cave. This seals the deal and... Yeah. We at least have some sort of Fenris leggings. Level 2, probably. Level 3 would be nice, but... I might need another cave for that. on gears, 34 on bows. It's getting there. Yeah, gotta have your door to nowhere. Traditional Valheim dungeon specialty. <laughs> Why not, Cena? Oh, where did you come from? What the hell, you freaky bastards? Oh, you're smart. You stayed out of the poison. Wow. Where did these guys come from? It's been here. There's more activity. Doggo room. Precious fine wood. Well, we want fine wood. We're holding fine wood. That's good. Yeah. And this guy. Gotten three bronze. That's all right. Got everything I care about. I don't have the inventory slots. Anything else? Um, yeah. Oh, I left some here. I'm an idiot. Ah. Hey, we are level 3 pants, baby. So 10 more. We are level 4 pants. That'll be a nice upgrade to our defense. Because these are 12. Level 3 pants of Fenris will be 14. And then, yeah. It's just a straight upgrade from Troll Armor, switching to Fenris. Um, Fenris Helmet... It'll look good on my wall, but I don't really have a slot for that. I'll pass on that for now, I'm sure we'll get more of those. I think that's it for this cave. We actually need some wolf pelts. Oh, for frick's sake. Could also do a Fenris coat to be frostproof. Um, I don't have pelts, so we need to use more mead. And yeah, we really need to get a storage going. Um. Where's the junk box? What can we put in the junk box? A bunch of that crap, but not all of it. Really need fine wood. In any case, we'll make our Fenris legging. No, we can't. We don't have a couple. 
So we need to take our portal around and go kill some wolves, I reckon. I've only explored a tiny part of that mountain. Iron heads. Where are my frost meads? I quick stacked them like an idiot. Oh yeah, it's a big boy, wow. Alright, next cave. Structure, let's go to the structure. I would love it if there was like a silver node up here somewhere. These are pretty good against the drakes. And now you're just dead. Ah, uh, hello, good morning. Um... Oh shit. What? What in the hell? What in the hell is going on? Ah, there's a lot coming at me as well. Everything's trying to kill me, even the trees. What in the world is going on? Wow, you see that wolf chomping the freaking hell out of him. Very hard moment. Wow. Oh man, I wish I had wood arrows for this. I'm gonna bow these bastards down. Oh, but you guys have missed me making that obnoxious noise. We need a bit of this, I think. A lot of running. I nearly died there. Damn it. Oh shit, hello. Uh, hi. Take that. Take that. Where's the box? Dude. I got robbed. There's the box. Oh, I did get robbed. What the hell? Okay, you guys do that. Um, I gotta find a cave. An attempt wolf hunting at night. Right, let's regen our stamina. I might go nighttime wolfing and bring wolves to those golems. Three golems. Wonderful. Holy golems. Run. I need you to entertain yourself. Where is, like, everyone else? I uh, hear a wall. Ah, 
Oh, it's actually a scam, this cavern. It yeah, will be, will be, will be. Woo! Bye bye, will be. That's alright, there's more. Boom! Take the wood. Thanks, man. This cabin here. Uh, let's. Oh gosh. So with the Unity engine upgrade, yeah, mobs climb like crazy. By the way, you see this shit? Oh, I think he finally got stuck. Triple Draga. Um. Probably just take the other two. Not particularly useful, no. Well, okay, our first cave was way down there. Where's the next cave? Is my. Oh, I nearly fell off there. That would have been death. Where would the next cave be? Wow, that's so steep, dude. Um, Drake Nest. There's a cave, is it? Da -da 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 -da. I kind of need wolves. Oh, and there's Drake's up there. Holy shit, they run so freaking fast. <gasps> oh! Wow, they're scary. They are so freaking scary. They're so fast. They are so damn fast. Oh my god. Yeah, very hard. Increases the well, speed of the mobs, but 20%. Um, after playing in Battle Axe series on normal mode, whoa, it's a big jump. Thing, the wolves just fly at you. So scary. That's nice of you. There are multiple wolves below me somewhere. Somewhere. Let's make our way to the cave and kind of want the stuff. Where are you bastards? Oh, I see you. Oh, shit. Have they actually Giga Chat en enough to get up here? Yes, they are. Holy cow, man. It's terrifying. Yeah, things just climb like freaking crazy. It's insane.
I'd like to not waste another mead. I'm just going to beeline this cave real quick. If there's a mob though, I'm going to pop the mead. How do you even get up that? I like that. All right. Might have left the pelt or two there, but we got enough, so it's all right. Oh god, wolves are scary. I think we're gonna die a lot in the mountains, man. Wow, they are scary. They are very, very, very scary. We made more frost meat somewhere. Let's start cooking that right now. Um, so I can't actually make my Fenris stuff now. Could make the coat, but I want the legs. Because I'm going to wear the root vest in the plains anyway. I'm going to always wear the Fenris <clears throat> legs though. I don't believe stacking heavy armor is good for very hard. I really don't. Because... Things move fast. Faster. You don't want to be any slower. <laughs> um, so what did I need for us, Mead, which is at this place? It has to be, right? No, we had a ready mead at the swamp base. I didn't get onion seeds yet. Bastards. I think the mead base is here. Yeah. Uh, we should pickle that up. It'll do spawn otherwise. Ouch. You dumb idiot. I can angry at me because you jumped into the freaking flamey dumbass. Man, they see you from so freaking far away, man. Go away. I don't care, cry more. Did I leave bronze at that first cave? I think I might have. Well, that's okay. We get the bronze in the second cave, which is like way over here. Run back to the first cave, pick up the bronze, and then bring it all home. And then win win. No. Do it like that. Alright, we need the S portal now. to get the rest of our storage house set up, but doing a bit of armor first, I suppose. Let's not waste too much time though, because yeah, we don't want that bronze despawning. <sighs> Lots to do. Yeah, nice view. Those pillars will be gone. Alright, so this guy... These guys... And... That guy... Yeah, the Fenris coat doesn't help me in the planes at all. Wow, crap, I don't have the stuff. Good to know. We need more boxes, dude. Yeah, it's a mess. 
Okay, food, mead, got everything I need. I not bother dealing with these guys right now. We have more mead, so, I mean, why not just use this one? There. Let's not fall down there. Okay, so cave. Holy shit, man. Yeah, because it's... it is a bat hole. Alright. Oh, and there's more. the crystals or not because the the via the dark wood pieces look really good without the shingles um the, the crystals i think so yeah but we'll see okay so that weighs nothing Way's also nothing. Got that way, and then all right. There's a door there. Oh shit! I should be careful. These will impale me. <laughs> you walked into it, you idiot. How's that poison going, man? I think there's a... Coming? Yep. That's it. Yeah, I'm resting. Wolves. 
Sometimes there's mobs behind there. Oh, hello. That's a lot of them. Jackpot. Nice, good cave. Seven bronze? What was that? I think that's it. And that was big money. Very nice. Just gotta pick up this portal and take it home now. Wonder if we can get out of here in just two minutes. Did we look in oh. To carry the portal, we're gonna have to make some sacrifices here, that's the thing. We should just drop our shit off. I'd like to get back without having to use yet another crossword, but... Don't know if that's gonna pan out. In any case, we want to hunt wolves. We can't even make our Fenris stuff. I should just use another frost meat because we got another. We got enough Fenris here to make another. To make a Fenris coat already. So yeah, I mean, why not? Don't forget to take this. Need to go find the bronze we left at the first cave and retrieve it. Kill any wolves we see. Obsidian, good for frost arrows. I didn't bring a pickaxe because I'm a dumbass. Oh, that's unlucky, dude. Where are the wolfies? Oh, there's a wolfie. This doesn't detect silver. Let's go back and get my sledge. 
Didn't know that. Sledge doesn't detect silver. It has to be stack breaker. I think I keep my old weapons. Um should be at swamp base, which is village. How about that then? The more you know. I wouldn't know because I never make the freaking iron sledge. But, man. Stack breaker really is OP. Need to get my pickaxe as well. Wouldn't mind hitting a bit of obsidian. I can't believe we haven't found freaking onion seeds yet, dude. What the hell's up with that? Is that fair? I don't think that's fair. What a mess. Oh, hey, we can make another box. Let's go. stone boxes I want to have two more here now the biome boxes will probably go over there realistically this is like wood four boxes for wood four boxes for stone metal metal and some other important crap and then have all the biome boxes over there together um, no we don't have enough stuff Oh, I don't need this for a little bit. Oh, I ripped my eye for your buff, dude. That's mountain, right? see one of those two hards and it's not an obsidian node. It has to be silver. your opinion did I ask I don't think I asked silver somewhere here. It's just a bit harder to find with this. A very silvery spot. Surely somewhere in here. Golems are kicking ass. Oh, 
Oh shit. Nice job, poison. Well, I wonder if they're getting wolf pups for me. Interested in the Drake, fair enough. He's cave number one. There's my stuff. Only three? Oh well. Not time. Come to. Oh, we got it, nice. Appreciate it without the lag, thank you. That frame drop. Well, I want to get wolf pelts, so... Put this bad boy here and run around for five minutes. Oh, we got him, nice, dude. What a game, man. Oh, shot! Oh my god. Get that guy. Behind you, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god! Two, two stars just like that! What the hell? Oof. Oh my god! <laughs> I killed the golem! Uh, that's bad for me, though. Where's the other golem? Is this just the end? Survive that. Holy cow. I think that's just mocking me in the Battle Axe series. Two two star wolves just like that, dude. Holy shit. I'm sure that won't be the last we're gonna see. The start mobs are way, way, way more common in very hard. They tore him to pieces, dude. Holy shit. But hey, check out the freaking loot we got. Still got two minutes. Oh god, heart is pounding after that. Can't believe I survived. Welcome to Henrik's channel, where I survive the most craziest shit ever and then die to the dumbest shit ever the next day. So, hey. You get the best of both worlds here. 
And if you like that, make sure you subscribe. One of a kind. So I don't even intentionally die to dumb shit, it's just me. Um, I'm trying to use the last two minutes my thing here and look for silver. There's got to be silver somewhere. Come on, dude. No, I don't need you coming over here right now. gentlemen. Say hello to this guy. Oh. Holy shit. He's running. He's scared, dude. He's out of here. He don't want none of that. Oh my god. Right. You got one. Wow. Did he get... Freaking hurt or what? Holy! A 250'd him. A zero star wolf 250'd him, even though he's resistant to slash. Holy shit. Holy shit, dude. I'm scared. That was a sneak hit, but still, that's ridiculous. I'm scared. Ah, uh, where's the portal? I gotta get back now. I don't know who said that. Oh, you said that. All right. Well. Where's my damn portal? I think it's just in the trench here. Go make some stuff. I think we can make Venus coat. We should have enough pelt after the double two star thing. Holy cow, man. That's scary. So, Black Forest continues to remain the biome that's killed us the most. die a lot though in the plains if not the mountain I kind of yeah and feel it coming those goblins the mosquitoes hurt uh, did not I get a bunch of fenris here I should have more than that. this bastard. Leather. What the hell is all my leather? Didn't I? Yeah. Wow, I'm actually burning through all my leather though. We need more bats. 
Thinner code, yeah. Good for the mountain. It's alright, the level 2 it's already on par with the troll crap. Yeah, we just need more boxes, really. Now we just gotta find silver. 4 hours 30, hmm, might be time to wrap though. Tell you what I want to do real quick is pay a little visit to our friends in the local spot. So let's get them. Oh, we have dehyde and bones actually. So we can do the D cape thing. I'll turn this into a wolf cape probably once I get more. Once I get two silver and wolf trophy or whatever it is. All silver, I don't know. Yeah, 52 armor. Excellent. It's improving. Oh, these guys are back. Hello. Yeah, they could help me take out this bastard. Yo. Oh, you're camouflaged. Hey, man. Oh, yeah, he got got. Now, who wins this? Probably the locks. Well, he's going to sustain massive damage, especially if he's looking at me. That guy's just free casting on him. What is the Lux doing? Winning. Oh. Oh, he squished a bird. Holy shit. A double mosquito there. just its shadow. Okay, pricks. I need fine wood. That means I need you idiots to get out of here. Oh, we have that two star there. Root vest ain't gonna save me from a two star spear, methinks. Let's get the sneak on him. Oh man. I don't think I stagger him if I spin too. Oh, I do. Ah! I need more stamina! is such a strong weapon. The fact an iron an iron weapon can just stagger that bastard in one hit, that's kind of ridiculous. On very hard. Wow. Man, my aim sucks or what? That's at least a one star. I knocked him off.
as a shaman. These are the bastards that came after me when I was chopping. of DPS. Oh, that's awkward. Oh, it got me! No! Oh, I was like one millisecond too slow on that spin. No, dude. Yeah, don't you tell me Aki is easy mode, dude. One mistake and you're dead with it. It is a melee weapon. There's nothing compared to as easy as using a freaking spear or a bow. You just perma stay out of their reach. Oh, dude. One millisecond too late. Death. I've been doing really good up until now, though. Not even mad, to be honest. I gotta get rid of this village. Oh, I should be careful of mosquito pricks. Damn bastards, man. It's doing really good, too. Oh, well. Pretty brave trying to add key of these bricks. But to be honest though, zero star, two star, I, any of them are gonna one shot me. It doesn't really actually make a big difference. Oh, he's out of the picture now. There's his stupid friend. Uh, I doubt I could stagger the berserker, that's probably unlikely. But we could try since we have corpse run anyway, right? Just knock off these bricks first. The frame dropping thing is really annoying. But anyway. The zero star? I'm on no skill drain, I might as well try. By the time I ride, I'll have a chance to dodge anyway. Nope. 
Nope, not gonna happen. <laughs> okay. How do I kill this thing then? Poison him down, I guess. Oh, for frick's sakes, guys. I'm trying to do stuff. You're the least scary of all. How are you not tame yet? Oh, berries despawned, but yeah, probably. That's Tart over here. Apparently. It's stuck in the tar. Hello. Are you coward? There's still many guys in here. Wow, all right. Shots. Oh, that almost got me. But be careful, they attack really fast. And they do go for their hit. I guess I should play it patiently, bait the attack, avoid it, then go for the spin immediately after. That's probably the smarter way to do it. Basically how I use any other weapon. Unless we're both gonna do the run around crap. What? Yeah, like this. Oh, bye! Whoa! You good, dude? Oh, 
I think you're the last one though. Not hearing any laughing. Oh, uh, we do want the crops. No one cares about big berries. Pretty sure about that. If we need leather and stuff, we know where to go. There's, um... Like, 40 leather here or something. How much did we lose? 34 bows, full arms 44, eh, it's fine. We're actually gaining levels as well because we're playing the game now. We can power level the bows pretty easily. We just get wood arrows and shoot locks, basically. Do that once I have a drug, a bow, I think. Alright, well, I think we'll finish setting up the storage next time. I kind of wanted to just kill some stuff and then wrap up for today, but um, that was good. We got building done, we got adventuring done, and progression. I think that was, you know, quite productive. We should put all this crap in here. We'll make a farm later. I want to get the warehouse done. Storage room. Sort it out first. It's got to be a priority. Find silver next time too. Yeah, alright, that's it for today, so thanks for watching and see you next time.